All right, guys, here's the latest in the Assassin's Creed Shadows drama. The upcoming game continues to receive massive backlash, with a petition in Japan calling for a total ban. And honestly, I get where they're coming from. We all know the game's historical accuracy is questionable, to say the least. Uh, the portrayal of samurai feels way off, completely ignoring their actual social standing and role in society. The whole Yasuke situation. Yeah, he was a real historical figure of African origin who was able to reach Japan in that era but shoehorning him into the game as a major character feels less like representation and more like a gimmick. Japan has a rich history full of fascinating figures, and it's a shame they chose to focus on someone who, while interesting, doesn't really fit the setting. The devs might argue, right, like, oh, but we have Naoi. Look, let's be honest, she feels more like a token inclusion to appease critics. Why not just have a badass Japanese samurai as the main character from the start? This petition isn't just about historical accuracy, though. It's also about cultural respect. Japan has a unique and complex culture, and it deserves to be portrayed with care and understanding. From what we've seen, Shadows falls short on that front. I read this one Japanese guy who shared his sentiments on Reddit, he said that he felt disrespected to see his ancestors get their heads sliced off and then stomped on by a foreigner. And I'm pretty sure we can all agree on how fucking disrespectful that is. I'm not saying the game is going to be a complete disaster. It could still be fun to play. But it's clear that Ubisoft missed the mark when it came to respecting and accurately portraying Japanese history and culture. I mean, obviously, it's kind of too late to make changes. I mean, I personally have very low expectations, and I probably not even bother buying the game, but what do you guys think about this petition? <laughs>